Sir Ed Davey. Madam Speaker, can I first of all congratulate the Honourable Lady, the Member for Mitcham Warden, on securing this question? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And can I agree with her that this horrible, appalling situation for the people of Sri Lanka has been brought about by the corruption of the Rajapakse yeah, yeah. government, their populist, unfunded tax cuts, their <laughs> skyrocketing defence expenditure, their draconian police powers, and their cronyism corruption, the like we've rarely ever seen? And therefore, can I urge the Minister? to work with international partners for a full economic and political solution to support uh, the uh, Democrats in uh, Sri Lanka. Uh, can we start with an economic package uh, with the IMF and others so we can give immediate support? But can that be followed and included with, with a political package which includes an international arrest warrant for President Rajapaksa and his cronies? Can it, can it also include a demand for political freedom, the respect of rights and human rights of everyone on the island of Sri Lanka, including the Tamil and Muslim minorities? Yeah, yeah. Uh, thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. I think what I would like to kind of reiterate is that you know, the political and economic challenges should be resolved through an inclusive and cross-party process. You know, we encourage all sides to find a peaceful, democratic and, and, and inclusive approach. And of course, we do work with our international partners on this matter. And I think I've already set out you know, the economic support that we've provided through uh, multilateral institutions such as the IMF, World Bank uh, and also organisations like the UN. Very fast.